Hello students, how are you all? Welcome to New Year 2025. So today we are going to discuss about tautomerism, the most amazing topic in the organic chemistry. It is linked to general organic chemistry, isomerism and also carbonyl compounds and grade 12 and aldehydes and ketones and carboxylic acids. And this topic definitely I can assure you that you are going to get one question from the NEET examination, grab 4 marks at the end of this today's session. And before going for this tautomerism, I would like to say India's largest scholarship examination score is incepted by Sri Chaitanya and infinitely learned by Sri Chaitanya. This score is India's largest scholarship exam. Why it is providing the scholarship worth of 1 crore rupees and also study setup and laptop and educational allowances and uh, up to 100% scholarship whatever you course opted for it. And this score examination is for any student you may be from Infinity Learn or from any college or any institute still you are able to write, you are eligible to write this examination. And this examination is only online, you can sit at your home and you can attempt this examination. Link is given in the description box and you can just click the link and enroll yourself and attempt the score examination and enjoy the entire facilities provided by the score. And also I am providing you NEET 2025 All India Test Series Pack and this test series pack is containing 27 AITS examination which includes 13 unit test, 4 part test, 10 grant test based on NEET pattern and 20 online NEET full syllabus mock test and 25 NEET topic wise PYQs and 3 physics, chemistry, biology books along with video solutions on the app and detailed solutions and performance reports on every test and last but not least your performance is based and benchmarked with the Sri Chaitanya students so that whatever examination you prepare it has to be properly assessed. The basic assessment and meticulous assessment can be done by using this test series pack so that bacho, you can just click the link available in the description box and you can enroll for that and this cost was 5999 on the special discount when you apply YouTube 50 coupon code YouTube 50 off coupon code, you will be getting 2999. It is too cheap and nobody is going to give these many facilities in India for the NEET preparation. You all do this and enjoy your NEET preparation. Thank you and also I am just providing you what is the details about the tautomerism. Tautomerism is also called as a desmotropism or cryptomerism. It is a special type of functional isomerism where the hydrogen present on the alpha carbon of the carbonyl group is going to be shifted to carbonyl oxygen so that another functional group is formed. So there is a dynamic equilibrium. So it's a special case of functional isomerism where two different structures of two different functional groups exist in the dynamic equilibrium is said to be tautomers and this phenomena is said to be tautomerism. And unlike this is a, a resonance, a resonance is actually a hypothetical phenomena and whereas the tautomerism is a real phenomena which actually exists in the aqueous solutions. And this may be an acid catalyzed or may be a base catalyzed. Do you have various types of uh, uh, tautomeric systems like 1-2 uh, system and 1-3 system? And among all, 1-3 system is going to be more important in the ketoenol tautomerism is seen. In this ketoenol tautomerism, it arises due to three migration of C alpha hydrogen to the carbonyl oxygen so that you are going to get another functional group which is in a basic media or acidic media. You can see here this is CH3 and C double bond O and CH3. Condition for tautomerism first of all. So does every compound shows tautomerism? It may or may not be. So what are the conditions? It should have at least one alpha hydrogen. So this is alpha carbon. This is also alpha carbon right? And the alpha hydrogen is going to migrate and from here to here. So for that there should be an electronegative atom and a multiple bond for that. 
So these are the two conditions to show the tautomerism. Condition number one, alpha hydrogen should be there. Condition number two, a multiple bond between electronegative atom. Then only it is going to show tautomerism. So if you say another structure like this, CH3 and CH3 and CH3 does not show tautomerism because it has no alpha hydrogen. So it is alpha carbon and it has no alpha hydrogen. Alpha hydrogen should be present. Of course, let us talk about this. This alpha hydrogen is going to be migrated from here to here. Then only this pi bond is going to be shifted. As a result of this, it is going to give you CH3. It can be done in this way as well. And it is going to be C and it is going to be OH. And there is a double bond over here. So there is a ketone group over here. So it is called as a keto form and there is a, a double bond and alcohol is there. So it is said to be enol. So there is an equilibrium between keto form and enol form. So this is what you said to be keto enol tautomerism. In this keto enol tautomerism, the equilibrium can exist in this way as well as in this way. But let us see the equilibrium principles in the next coming slide about this. So let us talk about this is an acid catalyzed or a base catalyzed. So let us talk about the base catalyzed. So this is acetone and uh, this is a enol form. So let us see the mechanism OH minus is going to be let us see here it is a partial negative charge and a partial positive charge. This OH minus is going to be attacked nucleophilic attack so that you are going to get OH over here is added so that it is enol form and this is your keto form. So this is your keto enol tautomerism. Now let us look into the which form is going to be more stable. There you are going to get a question from the NEET examination. Generally keto form is more stable than enol form but uh, some cases stability of enol is going to be more stable than keto form. Generally why keto form is more stable than enol form? Assertion, reasoning type questions, neat examination, there you are going to get a question like so keto form bond energy of C double bond O is greater than C double bond C. So the stability of the enol form is dependent on the stability of C double bond C. Keto form is converted into enol form. The process is called enolization. The enolization may be an acid catalyzed enolization or a base catalyzed enolization. So enolization is going to be more favored in the case of whenever intramolecular hydrogen bonding is there, whenever aromatic character comes into the picture like uh, you see uh, extended conjugation is there and steric factors. In these four factors, whenever any one of these four factors comes into the picture, you can say enol form is going to be more stable. Let us talk about an example over here, CH3, C double bond O and active methylene group is there, C double bond O and CH3. So active methylene group is going to be participated enolization, therefore I got an enol in this enol, you can say CH3 and C double bond O and CH double bond C O H and CH3. Now you can see cleverly there is an intramolecular hydrogen bonding. Because of this intramolecular hydrogen bonding, equilibrium is going to be more favored in the enol content. This is the way you have to understand this first point. And also in the aromatic character as well, in the aromatic character, this, so this is the keto form. In this keto form, there is an alpha hydrogen over here. You can see there is an alpha hydrogen and this alpha hydrogen is going to be migrated from here to here. As a result of this, I am going to get. O and this hydrogen is going to be with it and this is going to be aromatic. It is going to be phenol. 
so that equilibrium always is going to be forward in the more forward direction. So like that in which of the following the enol content is maximum is going to be the most expected question from the NEET examination bacho. So in the new year 2025 you all enjoy this type of sessions. I will show you some more examples for today and you can say it is a keto form and here you can see there is a hydrogen, there is a hydrogen shifted here and shifted here you got enol 99.99% and it is a phenol. And you can see a keto form there is a hydrogen over here and uh, there is a shift of the pi bond, shift of this pi bond over here so that you are going to get aromatic enolic form cyclopropenium ion is an aromatic in nature. So enol is more stable than a keto and also some more examples over here. So there is a pi bond over here. And this pi bond shifted here, proton is shifted from here to acidic hydrogen is essential for it. So this is still aromatic enol is more than keto percentage. And also you can see there is an intramolecular hydrogen bonding diketone and in this diketone hydrogen is shifted from here to here. So that you have got OH over here and C double bond over here there is an intramolecular hydrogen bonding the enol is more stable than keto due to intramolecular hydrogen bonding. So the organic chemistry, the structure and its uh, analysis is very important to squeeze one question and four marks from the NEET examination. And you can see one four tautomerism. Here alpha hydrogen is not shown, but here one four. So the hydrogen is going to be shifted from here to here so that Carbanion, carbanion is formed so that this carbanion is resonance stabilized to get a phenoxide ion to get enol content of the phenol. So this is also going to show the tautomerism because of the aromaticity this keto is converted into enol, enol is more stable. And also you can see a ketone so 2 diketone is taken but this is acidic hydrogen so that you got enolic form in the either side is also a beautiful example that can explain you enolization over here. So in today's class we had a discussion about what is exactly tautomerism in that I have given a more emphasis on keto enol tautomerism how keto is converted into enol and what are the factors that stabilizes enol content and based on you can expect a good question from this neat examination. So hope you like this session and wait for this kind of sessions and every day a short session for a short topic which is more important. Stay tuned, please like our session, share with your friends and subscribe to Infinity Lane Neat channel. Thank you, thank you very much.